English family, it's not a blazer here again. I am so excited to be back with you guys. And today I am going to demonstrate a few basic stretches and exercises that will help to keep the spine open and limber and in proper alignment. So none of us have actually back problems. Lately, I've been getting a lot of clients complaining about upper back and neck issues. And I truly believe it's because all of us since COVID have been spending a lot of time on the computers and also iPhones. Let's get started. Bring your feet, shoulder width in parallel, stomach pulled in, chin to the chest, slightly bend your knees and roll down vertebra at a time. Exhale, exhale, and exhale. Take deep inhale, pull your stomach in and roll up vertebra at a time and rest your shoulders. Again, take deep inhale through our nose, bring chin to the chest, and roll down vertebra at a time. Stomach pulled in, slightly bend your knees. Roll all the way down as much as you can. Please don't ever over push yourself. Please listen to your body. It is important to listen to your body and roll up. Take deep inhale. Exhale, this is your last one. Chin to the chest and roll down vertebra at a time as you pull your stomach into your back. And roll up as you take an inhale. And bring your shoulders down, look straight ahead. Lift your shoulders up to your ears and bring your shoulders around, shoulders circle. And two, and three, and reverse for three, one, and two, and three, and bend one elbow, reach up to the ceiling, and bend over and hold it, bend your elbow, extend for the wall, take it up, and switch, bring your right arm up, all the way up, stomach pulled in, reach over, Come back home and switch. And we're going to do one more time each side. Bend your elbow. Reach for the ceiling. Make sure your navel is pulled to the spine and reach over. Take it up and switch sides. Bend your elbow. Take it up. Reach over and stretch. Stomach pulled in. Reach. And let's go ahead and sit on the mat. Bring your feet in front of you. Place your hands underneath your thighs. Round your back and pull away from your knees, your back. Round your back and pull away. And take it up. Again, round your back and roll back. It's almost like you're doing sit up. And roll up. And last one, inhale and exhale, pull away and stretch that back towards the wall as you reach your forward with your fingertips. And take it up, beautiful. Bring your feet together, bring chin to the chest and slowly start walking your hands down your thighs and relax your back. Chin to the chest, pull your stomach in and roll up as you're walking your hands up. It's a very safe way to learn how to do a proper sit-up without putting any pressure and stress on your spine and your back. Again, chin to the chest, pull your stomach in, walk your hands down, relax your neck, bring chin to the chest, pull your stomach in, and slowly walk your hands up. And last one, roll back, inhale, Relax your neck on the floor. Chin to the chest. Pull your stomach in. And stretch. Beautiful. Bring one knee to the chest. And you're going to bring one foot up. And down one. Two. Three. Hold your foot up. Walk your hands all the way up to your ankle. Flex your foot. Point your toe. Flex your foot, point your foot. Last one, flex, point. You're gonna bring your foot towards you, 
and walk your hands down as you roll in your spine all the way down on the mat relaxing your back chin to the chest and roll up and give yourself a little stretch and again walk your hands down one step at a time chin to the chest and roll up pulling your stomach in and roll up vertebra at a time and stretch and last one roll back relax your neck and take it up vertebra at a time as you're rolling up chin to the chest and stretch switch legs bring your right knee to the chest bring your foot up and down one two walk your hands up hold down to the ankle flex your foot and point one two three and walk your hands down and roll down and roll up and stretch 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 relax and again roll back walk your hands down And roll up, take it up, 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 and stretch. And roll down, pull your stomach in. Chin to the chest and roll up. And give yourself a really nice big stretch. Beautiful, bend your knee, go on your back. Bring knees to the chest. Place your hands underneath. The knees, I usually actually, I like to put your hands underneath your knees instead of this way, because this way we are avoiding to put any pressure on the knees and overstretch the ligaments and tendons in the knees. Stretch, side to side, just a little rock. Beautiful, now place both hands underneath your bottom, raise both feet up, bend your knees, one, two, three, now you're gonna flex some point, one, two, three, and circles three times each direction, one, two, and three, and reverse, one, two, and three, hold it, lower one leg down, one, five times each leg, two, Stomach pulled in, make sure you have your back flat on the mat, three. Pressing your back down, four. Last one, five, switch legs. One, two, three, four, five. Bend your knees. Again, place your hands underneath. Just a little round back side to side. And let's go into a child pose. Reach forward, relax your neck, stomach pulled in. And now you're gonna walk your hands to one side and stretch. It is wonderful stretch to open up your back. And walk to the other side. And again, walk to the other side and hold it. Walk as much as you can. Pull your stomach in, press it back down. And let's go to the other side. And relax. 